it's Zena, Warthog Princess, and welcome to another What's in My Bag. This edition will be the Performance Twill Sling Bag in um, Deep Night Paisley Neutral. So this is the uh, first time I've really been using this bag for any amount of time. I've been using it for a few days while I was traveling with the RV and also plan to use it for this week going forward until I decide to change. So. This bag is actually very roomy. It holds a lot more than you would think. And it is water resistant, or water repellent even, I think they say, because of the Performance Twill fabrication. And it is still quilted, so it will protect things inside quite nicely. Also, these zippers are very nice, sleek, smooth, and very sharp looking, so I like them a lot. All right, without further ado, let's jump right in. So obviously, the sling backpack, this is the regular size, not the mini. Um, if you're wondering what this thing is on top, I know it's silly, um, it almost seems childish. I really don't care, frankly. Um, but it's a Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer. So you got the little thing there, so. But it matches, so there you go. That's gonna stay on there all week. I just added that right before this video, so we'll see if I like it, but. Um, in the front, you have one zipper pocket right here. In this pocket, I just have keys. So I have my big old key fob for the truck, and then I have my Vera Bradley shopping tag doofer. So that's kind of a nice little thing there. I think I have like 16 tag things in there. And then just random keys and whatnot. It makes it a little bit bulky to put them in this front pocket just because they are bulky, but it doesn't over bulk the bag and it's plenty, it's fine. Um, the next pocket is sort of an admin pocket. I have, well, <laughs> I have a, you, you look at the back, the hanger clinic locations. I, it's a prescription for orthotics and an ankle brace. Anyway, this is my tech pouch. This is one of the new factory patterns and unfortunately I'm forgetting the name of it. Uh, I'll put it in the remarks below, sorry about that. Um, but I think it actually, the pattern-wise, kind of matches this one, even though the colors don't. It was the closest match I had in my tech cases. But inside here, I have a screen wiper. I've got a Vera Bradley external charger and a plug. Of course, you got to have the cord, the lightning cable. And then I also have another Vera Bradley charger. Now, normally, even my phone doesn't need that much charging at any given time, but... It is getting older, so 6S Plus. And since I was traveling, I actually used a lot of chargers. Another video coming on that, not Vera Bradley related, but trailer and RV stuff. Uh, I'm gonna start another playlist with all that. But anyway, so it's got my tech case, and then it also has the small spiral notebook in Springtide Navy. And then you can see I have some pens, pencil, eraser in there. And that's it for this pocket. So in this pocket, I just put this notebook in that little slip in there nicely. And then this one, I just put right in there and I leave the thing on there, the lanyard, and zip it up. But again, it fits really nicely. If you look at the profile, it does look like it bulks out just a little bit, um, but that's okay. It doesn't matter. All right, main pocket. So this is where most of your bigger stuff will go. I actually have four items in here. I have my non-Vera Bradley RFID card thing with all my non-essential cards that you need for other things. I've got my all-in-one crossbody wristlet, which I'm using as my wallet um, or grab and go if I just wanna take that. I've got my coin purse and Deep Night Paisley. Oh, sorry, this was in Holland Garden, of course. Now that those colors in there. I won't show the inside of it because it's got all my stuff in it, but but this I will. The coin purse, this I actually got as a birthday gift. Um, I know that was non-standard, but that was what my store sent with my order on my birthday, so that was really cool. Inside I have gum, cinnamon gum. I have chapstick, which fits nicely in that little elastic on the side. And I've got Altoid minis. And then I've got three little Listerine things. There are three different flavors and they're in that slip pocket on the side. Oops. <laughs> they're slippery little buggers. Anyway, so I just put those in the slip and zip it right up. 
put that back in. Well, I'll put it back in in a minute. So the fourth thing I have, this is the Mini Cosmetic in Performance Twill Deep Night Paisley. So this is the same fabrication as the bag. I will say a couple things about this. One, I think actually it is a great size. It's perfect for the sling. So the mini size or the mini dome size are great. Um, I like that it's, you know, pretty robust. Not that you necessarily need it. It's pretty well protected. But this particular one, I mean, look at how crooked it is. I was looking at the video where I did the haul on this and I thought, gosh, that looks crooked, but it couldn't possibly be as crooked as it looked in the video. I thought it was just because it wasn't like stuffed all the way. Um, yeah, it's crooked. <laughs> it is really crooked. And it's not just um, a visual illusion with the pattern pieces. It, it actually is very crooked. But, I mean, what are you gonna do? I mean, this not buying anymore, I'll tell you that. All right, so front pocket, nice little pouch here. I have band-aids, a little comb, got some rubber bands for my hair and a little mini mascara thing just in case. And that's it for the front pocket. Well, kind of my long skinny flat stuff. And then in the main pocket, I have actually a lot of things. You can see actually, it's pretty full. So I have my little Holland Garden Vera Bradley manicure kit. If you haven't seen these, they're great because they're actually very slim profile and they have all the men essential items in there. So I have that, I have my little pill case with multiple. It's got like Aleve and Motrin and some migraine meds and some Tums and just whatever you might need. Got some scent wipes and some Vera Bradley lotion samples. Got some dental floss toothpick dupers. There's another lotion. Some eye drops and another nail file. I can't remember where I won this, but I won this. It's actually a really nifty, like glass one, but it works really, really well. Anyway, so got kind of redundant with the nail kit and the nail file, but it works. All right. Doo -doo -doo. Gotta put everything back so it fits back in there. And this is the one tricky piece because it's a little bit big. And since the hand sanitizer is in the bunny, I don't need to put it in there. All right, so I put that in the bottom since it's like the bulkiest item. And then I put my next bulkier item. I just put it in right on top and I put the handle out in case I want to grab it by the my little thing. And my other little thing. And zip it up. That's it. So all of the stuff I need, actually there's more than I need, but... The one more pocket is this one right here. This one goes all the way across the bag, but this is where I put my phone. There's my Success Plus with Bandana Swirl. But it goes right in there really nicely and zips up. So when you have the bag on, you can just slide it around and your phone's right there, right in front. So that's how I use it. I, I'm over the shoulder. I think you can sling it the other way, but since I'm right-handed, this actually works perfect for me. And I forgot to put my thing. I have to make an appointment to go get orthotics. Yay. So put that in there so I don't lose it. And that is Performance Twill Sling in Deep Night Paisley Neutral. What's in my bag? Hope that was helpful to you just to see kind of what it can hold. There is more space. As you can see, there's a lot more give there. Um, I don't like to carry a fully stuffed bag in general, but any given day, it might be more or less stuffed anyways. So that's it for this one. Take care. Bye for now.